Hey everybody, this is Tyson with Fuel Systems Research and Development. I'm in the process of putting this fuel vaporizer on my generator now so that I can do some good testing with good data. This will allow me to plug in specific loads and test the difference between a cold vapor system and running my engine traditionally through the carburetor. So, you can see down there, um, if I pull this black hose off, that black hose is just a return line, it's a drain line, um, and the white barb fitting is where the fuel line goes. This right here is my gas tank, and what I'll do is I'll have my T right here for that. Um, so I'll be able to send fuel through to um, the vaporizer, and I'll have another valve on there so that I can send it through to one. One will be for the carburetor, one will be for the vaporizer. Um, so yeah. But what I have here is I'm building the flashback protection for this particular system. I have one flashback arrestor built already and this will work with gasoline, propane, or natural gas. It will not work with HHO. So do not try it with HHO. You can use this same method for HHO but stuff stainless steel wool inside of it in between um, a couple of screens to hold everything in there but if you do not do that correctly then yeah your system will explode but this right here um, gasoline is pretty easy to stop a backflash and see if I can get you to see into there I don't know if it'll focus or not but you can see the screen in there there we go there it is and how it works is this right here is this is a half inch pipe thread, uh, male pipe thread, and this right here is a female hose bib. And this side right here is a male hose bib and then a male half inch pipe thread. And then right here in between is where we have the screen mesh. This right here is um, one of the gaskets for a hose, it's a filter screen that you can get for any hose fitting, for like a garden hose. Um, and that works very nice to seal. It, it, it creates a good seal when I, thread, when I thread this piece into here. And then it also works as a really good backflash arrester. And this right here just goes on the top and that allows me to screw the um, barbed fittings into here, into the tops of these so that I can attach the hoses to them. Um, so I will have one flash arrestor, a flash arrestor on each line. You could do just a single one um, at the intake, but I prefer to do it on each line individually. Um, then I'll also be placing some check valves in, and I'll show the whole system once it's done, but I wanted to do a video on a flashback arrestor for fuel vapors, since there's not really a very good one out there for that. So. Again, I'll go through it one more time. I have half inch pipe. This is a hose. Basically, all you would need is a hose bib fitting. Um, female and a male with the gasket in between. Screw them together. It doesn't matter what this size is. It would be, you know, for whatever size you choose it to be. Three quarter, half, whatever. And the coupler, and that's how it works. Pretty simple. You could always double these screens up. Put one facing one direction, one facing the other. Um, and place it down in there to have double protection but this will work just fine. These are pretty beefy screens. They're really tough. It'd take a lot to blow through that. You're not going to blow through that on a backflash from gasoline so uh, it'll last a long time too. But alright. Hope you enjoy. Please rate, comment, and subscribe and thank you for watching.